Minecraft has existed for over a decade now, and in that time, millions of people have been able to grow their skills and show it to the world. There's some incredible builders, coding masterminds, and unbelievable PvPers. But there's also a huge variety of insane redstoners who have been able to show their technical Minecraft skills in the craziest ways. In this video, we're gonna dive into the field of redstone and answer the question, who are Minecraft's most insane redstoners? I'm gonna be listing four YouTubers based on popularity, skills, and just dedication. By the way, this list isn't ordered in any way. But now, we're gonna start off with the most well-known redstoner on this list, and someone I watch a ton, Mumbo Jumbo. If you watch Hermitcraft, you definitely know who Mumbo is. With him being on YouTube for nearly 10 years and over 8 million subscribers, Mumbo has definitely made an impact in the Minecraft community. In his time, he has been able to show off his redstone skills by making hundreds of tutorials and some insane farm designs on Hermitcraft. Speaking of Hermitcraft, he has been on the server for over 8 years now and the majority of his prominent contraptions come from Hermitcraft, like his giant heart in Hermitcraft 7 and his gold farm. His great personality and presence on Hermitcraft is why I think Mumbo's channel is so successful and his collaborations with people like Green also help his channel grow. But Mumbo isn't the only successful redstoner in the Minecraft community. Tango Tech has also gained quite a bit of popularity for his redstone knowledge. Dating back to over 10 years ago, Tango has gained over a million subscribers, and in that time, he has been able to make nearly a thousand videos for his audience to watch. In his decade of content creation, he has been able to show his redstone talents by making so many tutorials, some of his what if videos, and especially Hermitcraft. This man joined Hermitcraft in Season 2, and while he was on the server, he was able to make most of his insane amalgamations, like decked out. This guy's been working on this project for over a year, and where he makes something that's kind of like a card game, but in Minecraft. Now that's some serious dedication. Not to mention, he's also been on some other SMPs in the past, like Green's Life series. But Hermitcraft isn't the only SMP that's known for its incredible redstoners. Psycraft also has some of the best redstoners in Minecraft history, one of which being Il Mango. With over 800,000 subscribers and being on the platform for nearly 10 years, Il Mango has been showing off his redstone abilities for a very long time now. In his time on YouTube, he has made some of the most sophisticated contraptions in Minecraft history. This man is a wizard with redstone, building things like zero tick sugarcane farms, TNT dupers, and a literal diamond farm. How is that even possible? Anyways, he is a part of the Psycraft server, which has some of the most talented and dedicated Minecraft players of all time. They push Minecraft's boundaries to the absolute limit, getting the record for the most amount of diamonds obtained in survival mode, and even getting bedrock in survival. Yeah, his presence on the server has definitely had a positive impact on his channel, allowing him to collaborate with many other large YouTubers. But overall, I'd say that he is the best redstoner in Minecraft history, and will definitely solidify his name in redstone. But now let's get on to someone who pioneered early redstone, Ethos Lab. With around 2.5 million subscribers, Etho has been on YouTube ever since Minecraft beta, and in that time, he has been able to show his redstone abilities by making a ton of tutorials, and especially, Etho plays Minecraft. This Let's Play series has been ongoing for over 12 years, ever since Minecraft Alpha. Now that's some dedication. He's also a part of Hermitcraft, which has helped this channel grow, 
by making him collaborate with other creators and helped build his incredible technical Minecraft skills. But the thing I find most admirable about Etho is that over the years, he has been able to build up such a loyal fan base. He doesn't upload custom thumbnails for his videos and has little to no editing when uploading, yet he still gets hundreds of thousands of views on every video he makes. And I respect that. Oh, and by the way, this man literally invented early bud switches. So yeah, those are four well-renowned redstoners who have definitely made an impact in the Minecraft community. Mumbo Jumbo, Tango Tech, Il Mango, and Ethos Lab. Which YouTuber on this list is your favorite? Mine is Mumbo, but what is yours? And by the way, you should go check out my previous video about a different redstoner called Exumavoid. Don't forget to like and subscribe, but anyways, goodbye fellow viewers.